I was fortunate that I was the first member of my family on either side to go to college. And there was never a thought that I wouldn't. So my parents made sure that I paid attention and that I showed up on time and they were very supportive. And I've said this many times, but for the public school system and that which I have gotten from it, it laid the foundation that made everything else that I've had the opportunity to do and engage in possible. One of the reasons that I have stayed engaged in educational issues and organizations like the Board of Governors, et cetera, um, while it was not conscious, it just seemed very natural uh, that that was a wonderful place where you could try to uh, balance the ledger, if you will, and, and give back. And certainly the demand and need for engagement from the community is there. Also happened to marry a public school teacher. Carol uh, and I met at Appalachian and, and she taught in public schools for a number of years before she retired. So uh, she too is an activist uh, in that regard. And of course that gives me inspiration and motivation to do my part. Around 1992, when Governor Hunt ran for Hunt 3, I can remember like it was yesterday, the phone ringing, and he presented me with a life-changing and wonderful opportunity to become general counsel. And I'll never forget, one of my law partners said, we don't want you to leave, and we don't want you to do this, but you must, because for a lawyer that loves public service, this is the perfect job. I learned a lot. Uh, working with and at the side of uh, Governor Hunt. A never say never, never say die attitude when it's the right thing to do. Uh, I saw that in practice inside the government of North Carolina. Well, another pivotal point uh, in my career was when I had the opportunity, which was unplanned and premature from my life planning perspective, was when I had the opportunity to become General Counsel at Blue Cross Blue Shield, and it would, where I stayed for 22 years. And uh, I had a great experience there for 16 years. I was honored to have the opportunity to serve as chair of the Board of Governors for four. And that did nothing but continue to uh, whet my appetite for more involvement in public education, business leaders, large and small. There is a place in your community that has a need and I simply believe that we are obliged to give back to something that is meaningful to others that fits our passion. I, I will admit that um, in the first 30 minutes I was thinking about it after you called, I wondered how many of my high school teachers would uh, believe it. Uh, I accept this honor um, and am touched by it because of all of the people whether it was in the schoolhouse or the church house or on the athletic fields, in my family, um, but for all of their investment in me, you and I would not be having this conversation. And so on their behalf, uh, I accept this uh, honor and um, thank you again.